Good morning. Welcome back to Market Masterclass. Here we are every morning giving you our fresh perspective on daily stock picks, looking at the market, what's going on out there in the world, and where best to put your money. And that's what we do here at In Market to Market. So uh, today is an exciting day, Monday, October 24th, our last trading week of October. October has been uh, kind of not so good on the market for here in America, at least uh, for the most part, but it's ramping up to turn things around towards the last push towards the end of the year. But with the U.S. election just around the corner, still a lot of uncertainty, a lot of volatility out there as to uh, how things will turn depending on the outcome of that. So uh, that is still yet and remains to be seen. But what we can look at is what's happening in the headlines today. And as any of you who are actually following and not... Uh, completely oblivious as to what's going on in the world, then you've probably heard about this right here. The biggest takeover of the year, uh, which is AT&T looking to buy out Time Warner. Valued at $107 billion, it's actually, uh, uh, after all the debts and everything, it's an $85 billion deal. And uh, so obviously Time Warner stock jumped at the announcement over the last couple of days. You can see that over the last three months, it's had a pretty steady, you know, slightly vol volatile. Uh, and actually even over the course of the whole year, uh, the beginning of the year was at $73 and it was just here at $78 up prior to this announcement. So uh, relatively, relatively steady over the course of the year. And after the announcement, boom, it shoots up dramatically uh, well over ten dollars a massive percentage for a, a major blue chip stock like this so uh, this is all under the rumors that it's going to happen but here is the kicker both Bill Clinton and Trump are wary of such a Time Warner merger this also if you go on to read and do some research about this that both administrations no matter who takes office are a little bit wary of such a, uh, a buyout and that there's a lot of different things that happen to actually make this work uh, and that means approval from the government. So this being the case, I can say that this massive jump in stock price is definitely a, a reaction. And it's not even, you know, there's no contract, nothing's, there's a lot has to happen before this ends up happening. So I'm thinking that this stock will definitely come back down to, you know, to make sense, come back down out of the clouds get back to where it's been typically trading. And yes, uh, it will maintain some of the strength while these rumors are still pending, but uh, it shot up almost to $90. I'm gonna go short on the short term on Time Warner Inc. TWX because I think that uh, as they start to realize the practicality of making this deal happen, that it will start to come down off of its headlines, come down off of its uh, uh, the crazy trading day it had uh, on uh, on uh, Monday or last Friday so um, here we are let's see what happens I'm gonna follow this but uh, I am gonna go short on this I think it's gonna kind of come back down at least uh, three four five percent and then we can look at re-entering if this deal looks like it's going to close because obviously it's gonna make time one very valuable getting picked up as the biggest deal of 2016. So short on the short term on Time Warner because this deal very may not happen if either administration that takes office is not for it and the government has to approve such a merger. So I am uh, I'm betting against it in the, in the short term. So that's where I'm at. This is Kenyon Martin. You heard it here first on Market Masterclass going short on TWX on the short term. Thanks all for stopping by. We'll see you here bright and early tomorrow morning before the market opens and happy week trading ahead. Be safe out there and get off your tush and start doing it for yourself, guys. Trade. You're not going to make money. Make money for yourself sitting around watching other people do it. So.